So I just want to clear up some confusion with my previous video on how to do a clean install of Windows 10. Now in the previous video I didn't add a product key because I don't have a Windows 10 product key. So in this video I'm going to show you how to do a upgrade from a previous version of Windows. So this is Windows 8.1. Now I'm going to upgrade this to Windows 10 Pro. So if you're waiting for the update to come down as I am here, I still haven't got it. There's a quick and easy way to get this. So go and watch my previous video on how to download the Windows 10 ISO. Once you have the, the ISO, come back to this video and then I'll show you the process. So from here, we want to mount the ISO, as you can see here. And simply, we're just going to run the setup.exe and we'll click yes. So this will go through the steps of preparing Windows 10 to be installed. Uh, and like I said, this will use your pre-existing key on the operating system. For example, mine's going to be Windows 8.1. It will use that key to go forward. So I'm just going to click on not right now, and then I'm going to click on next. So here we're going to agree to the license. Okay, so as you can see, I am ready to install Windows 10. And here we can click on change what to keep. Uh, so from here we can basically keep personal files or that sort of thing. So here we're going to keep our files, apps, and Windows settings. I guess that's the default setting. And uh, I'm going to click next. Okay, so we're good to go. I'm just going to click on install, and that is now going to start the whole process of upgrading to Windows 10 and it will use your pre-existing product key for the operating system you're upgrading to. So as you can see once the computer restarts for the first time it starts to do the upgrading process. Now this is pretty boring to sit here watching this so I'll pause the video and come back shortly. So the computer has just restarted again uh, so it's now finished copying the files so now it's installing the features and the drivers. Okay, so the computer has just rebooted for the third time and is now just configuring the settings, so it shouldn't be that much longer. Okay, so that has now finished in upgrade process. I just need to quickly log back in. So from here, I'm just going to select Use Express Settings. And again, I'm just going to click Next. And then it's now going to go through the Hi, Welcome. Uh, and we should be back into our computer, but that now we will have Windows 10. Okay, so you can see the upgrade process has completed. We're now back on the desktop and this is now Windows 10. So if we do a WinBur, you can now see Windows 10. And we can also check the, uh, to make sure it's actually licensed. And if we go here, we can see Windows is activated. So that is the process that you have to go through to upgrade from a previous operating system to Windows 10. And it will use your previous key. So I just want to thank you for watching and I will see you all in the next one.